don't know, this is Isaac Jusenko, W2 Commander, here showing you the UK Arms M Series rifle. And my gun, my thing's going everywhere. Like always. But, box around and get to it. Just this tripod. Just this tripod. Alright, so this is without the grenade launcher. I'm um, too with the grenade launcher that comes with it. But this is the gun. What you have is your basic gay instructions, which you don't care about. Your D Boys 9, 8.4 um, volt battery. Your uh, speed loader. 100 bullets. Um, your second barrel type, which I like this one better, it's just a pain to put on with the battery in it. Um, confusing strap thingies, all this crap right here is all confusing. Um, a rubber plated, rubber plated, uh, retract the stock. Sidewind bar for your rails. A grip. A grip. A um, cleaning rod. Um, it actually looks like a light, but it's actually a place where you put the battery in on your rails. Uh, some bolts, you know. Two magazines, um, and your famous uh, UK Arms M series um, D Boy Sling M4. Now, this gun is well powered. Um, it's made out of metal and plastic, so it's made out of both. It has a metal gearbox metal um barrel um the um clip is kind of metally the railing system is metal and that's pretty much it that's metal on the gun everything else is plastic the body frame is plastic the stock is plastic the stock holder right here is plastic um the trigger is plastic the grip is plastic. The rails are plastic. The the uh, barrel assembly is plain. The barrel assembly is metal. The thing that covers up the barrel right here is plastic. Um, the grip is made of high quality um, plastic. Plastic. Electrical. Well, plastic, I guess. Plastic. Um, plastic. Plastic, China, 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 and China. And it, this thing also comes with some stupid warranty, like for your gay purchase and your freaking bill of $116.65. Um, but anyway, uh, getting to the gun now. Um, the gun does have rails for your rail mounts. And the thing that I was showing you here, this thing right here, you put on the side of your roll mounts. So I put it on this side because I, I usually aim on this side and it kind of looks like kind of cool when you do it like that. So I play it like that. Put your carry handle, your front sight, your rear sight. It does have foldable, um, if you didn't see yet. Oh, yeah. yeah. It does have foldable iron sights. Um,. It does have adjustable and retractable uh, carrying handle. So you can take it off. You don't really use it anymore. And you can adjust it to where you want to put it at. So that's pretty cool. It does have hop up availability right here inside there. It's similar to the M16 and TAR 21. Um, the weapon modes are. 
the weapon modes are um I'm put back safe, a semi, an auto. You do have trigger release. Press it down, bring it out. You have two capac I mean two clips that come with the gun. High and mid capacity. High is capacity is three hundred round. Um, mid capacity is fifty round. Um the black tip is spray painting because I did that. Um like I said. Um the uh, action and also the front the front um sling mount right there. That's metal. I wanna put that in just in case. Um if you are asking how to disassemble this gun, uh, I gotta reply for that. Uh, how to disassemble the gun and stuff like that. I'm trying to figure that out. My friend works at a repair shop, so he might help me out with that. Answer the question, some questions about it. But I do not think I do not think they're gonna be able to take the whole gun apart. But you might be able to take some pieces off of it that you might be able to use. So, um, but anyway, uh, um, the grip. It's comfortable, but it does not have the thing on the bottom. It's just like that, so it's kind of like pointless to use that. Thing, but I like the grip anyway. Um, the gun does shoot three ten feet per second. Um, it is powered by battery, and this gun is not lipo ready. Trust me, it's not lipo ready. So don't even ask that question. Because my friend used to have this gun, and he bought an 11.1 volt battery online. It blew the gearbox 20 minutes easily. 20 minutes. Um, gearbox was melted. So, I not melted. I meant um, just screwed up. But he did fix it, cause you know he does work at a repair shop. So, but anyway, um, you can buy this gun off of Hivetron.com. Or airsoftmegastore.com. Um, go Hobby Tron, it's cheaper. I just bought mine off of airsoftmegastore.com. Um, let me tell you the rest of the stuff. Um, retractable stock, uh, four point, it's 20, 40, 16, 80. All the way back, all the way forward. There we go. Um, this is how you do take out the hop up right here. So, that's pretty cool. Um, let's see. Yeah, like I said, the um, the uh, the nail launcher that you get with the gun, which I do not have, is a pain to put on. So is the uh, sling. So I advise you to get like your own sling. You know, get your own seriously. And um, let's see what else. This right here, is push leverage. It's for no use, so don't ask for anything of that. Like, why is that for? It's for no use at all. Like, none. Positivo nunny. Um. That's pretty much the M series. Uh, UK Arms M series M4. Um, that's pretty much all to the gun. Uh, I hope you like this review. Make sure to subscribe, rate, and comment, please. Especially, this is our new merch partner page. And also, you can check out our other two pages. WCP Airsoft and Bob Dog um, 173. Alright, I uh, hope you guys have a nice day and subscribe!